Clackamas County is a great place to have livestock, but with livestock comes manure management. And if you don't manage manure properly, you can actually get runoff that can cause pollution into streams, rivers, and groundwater. I'm Susie Cloutier. I'm the executive director of Zeb's Wish Equine Sanctuary. We're a 501c3 nonprofit horse or equine rescue and sanctuary here in Sandy, Oregon. The property size is only five acres, so we're a very condensed spot. We serve seven equines currently here on the property. We're on a small tributary stream to Tickle Creek, which flows into Deep Creek, which flows into the Clackamas River. This river basin is the last sanctuary for five threatened and endangered salmon species. So we knew we had to do something unique and interesting to manage our manure here at the sanctuary so that we can continue to be good stewards. We looked into a variety of different options and the best option for us really was to have this O2 compost system. What it is is a fully contained manure system. It's got concrete floors with plenum boxes. It's oxygen assisted and it is roofed. So there is no way any leachate can come out of our compost and leach into our soils and water systems. We produce about 130 pounds of manure from the stalls between the shavings and the manure and urine every day. We dump it in our filling bin. So we have three bins here. One we're always filling, one is cooking, and one is usually curing. Once we have a bin that's filled with manure, we can let the oxygen or the air start flowing through it. So we open a gate that allows the fan to cycle on into the particular bin that it's filled, forcing that air up through the pile. The most amazing thing about this system is I don't have to turn it. No one needs to touch it through the whole composting process. So it is easy for any kind of landowner to utilize and it'll be completely composted after three months and ready to just be shut down and sit and cure. And then it can be applied to all sorts of things. We apply it in the spring and the fall to our fields to help amend our soils. In the summer, we add it to our vegetable gardens and our fruit orchards here on the sanctuary. We also donate a very large portion of this forward to community food banks and gardens so that they can grow their own food. When we purchased this property, knowing that it did have a few challenges on it, meaning slopes, creeks, uh, combining equines with slightly beaten up pastures and no heavy use areas, we contacted the district early on so that we can get coaching through putting our infrastructure in and they have been so helpful. Not only have they been incredible with getting this compost system in, but also with every little soil and water challenge that we've had on this property. It's so great to be able to have a resource like them to pick up the phone and call. So if you'd like to learn more about manure management or need technical assistance in dealing with your manure and livestock, please give us a call at Clackamas Soil and Water Conservation District. <laughs>